and welcome back to my channel so for today's video as you can tell by the thumbnail and the title i am sitting down to film my what i got for christmas 2021 so it is a bit late factors thrown in to why this video is more delayed but i really hope you enjoy it nonetheless i have been really sport this year i was not expecting any of this like me and matt had set ourselves like the things we wanted to get each other but his family sport me my family sport me and i'm just very very grateful um so yeah i hope you had a lovely christmas no matter what you did and yeah i hope you enjoy this video i got from work so i got this really cute little bag and i'm really excited about it because i thought that goes into some of my gifts from work it's been amazing so i've got this little bottle of prosecco which i can now put in the cupboard not to drink because i'm actually doing dry january um i've got a big bottle of water because I, throughout 2021 and my other 20 years of existence, I have not drunk enough water to stay hydrated. So, we're doing that. However, I will definitely enjoy this. The next one came in this bag. Very cute again. Um, so, I've got a couple of bits in here. So, I've got this Coco & Co. Crokey the Belgian Cho Milk Chocolate Frog. How cute. Jesus, reindeer. We have a really nice Garnier Moisture Bomb Tissue Mask. And if you're wondering, yes, I am wearing my Thumper Disney pyjama top, because why not? Um, and then we've got two really cool bath bombs. Um, and I've got coconut fizzer and a strawberry fizzer. And they both smell absolutely amazing. I've got this bag here. Dawn, Marianne and their partners. I got this really nice scarf. I absolutely love this. I did ask for a scarf for Christmas. It may sound really basic. However, I love this so much. The colouring is so, so nice. Um, and, you know, in those colder months, and I just love a good scarf. Accessorise it, you know. Made me look really nice and cosy. So thank you so much, Dawn, Marianne and their lovely partner. This I got from work. I got this cow shed. Relax and sleep little treats. Sleep pillow mist. Relax travel candle. Bath, sh bath and shower gel. So I've had cow shed before from work um, and it was amazing. The shower gels were so nice. So you literally, how cute is this little gift set? Like seriously, look at that. It's not gonna focus on it. There you go. I also got some truffles from M&S. Um, I love truffles and Christmas just isn't Christmas about truffles and that's what they look like. Like how good do they actually look? And from my colleague Amy, we all got matching, which I thought was really, really cute. Um, and she was really, really, really lovely of her. So I've got a hot water bottle, which I've got to be honest, I've always wanted one. I think I've had ones in the past, but I've just ended up getting rid of them because they're not me. However, this is just so me. Really cute little reindeer, two pairs of fluffy socks. Now we all know I love fluffy socks. I will wear these whether it's Christmas or not. Um, so I'm really grateful for these because you know, these are just winter essential. And from my boss, she spoiled us so my boss loves a theme she loves a theme and disney is her theme so um we got a personalized notebook so mine has an l on it and this is going to come in real handy so i'm going to use this to help um be sort of like my budget and sort of work out my finances kind of things disney socks which are just a chocolate spoon mini mouse celebrate with magic um chocolate cookies so i'm going to take the cookies out and i'm going to use these to store christmas decorations so i wanted a festive tin and this is just the absolute cutest the main gift she gave us was a primark gift card which i've already already used like i think 20 something pounds of so she very kindly gave us a primark gift card which is going to come real handy to get me some more wintry jumper so spoiled us and not only did she get us those she also got it was like a rite of passage of what she always does every year a pandora charm and i got nemo I want, it just it makes me emotional i don't even know why i'm such a sob i don't know how well you can see that from malika oh we're gonna go into what malika got me for christmas so we did a christmas swap we're sorting out my parcel because it got posted to her i sent her my proof of postage but royal mail have somehow ballsed up so we're gonna try and sort that out as quick as possible but the Malika, first thing I got was this. It is a gorgeous handbag. Like, I opened this up in one of my festive vlogs. It is so nice. It's got a pocket on this side. It's also got this really lovely clasp. This is the box I got. Open it up. And obviously, because you don't have a Christmas Day vlog from me, you wouldn't have seen me open any of this. So, I'm not going over this quickly to be ungrateful. I'm going over it to show you the products and the very nice gifts that she gave me for Christmas. Um, but I'm trying to be so you're not here for hours and hours. But yeah, I'm so grateful, Malika. You well and truly support me and I am just, you're amazing. 
So I got this Dirty Work Night Time Duo. You get a pillow mist and a eye mask. It's as if she knows me too well. This is probably one of my favourite presents she got me. I loved everything. This is a gin cocktail um, mixer set. So you have your gins and then you just add a bit of this to add a different flavour. So I could you get the normal Gordon's normal box salmon gin instead of pink gin and just add these as different flavours. And obviously I'm not going to be using this this month. However, they can go in my cupboard. They can wait patiently for me. Um, and yeah, you get a raspberry, rose flower, mandarin, elderflower and lime. And I just love the idea of this. And she just knows me, as I said. Too well, I'm clearly too predictable. But I just thought it was really, really cool. I've got a bunch of chocolates. Um, so I've got Terry's chocolate orange bar. I've got some Milky Bar Festive Friends. Malteser reindeer. You know, clearly people know I love Maltesers. Um, I then got quite a few beauty products, which I'm really excited about. So I've got two EOS lip balms. Never actually tried these before, so I'm really excited. We've got the... What flavour is this? I don't actually know, but I'm just going to assume it's some sort of which of course I'm going to take full use out. Soap and Glory bits and pieces. So I've got this Rush Hour, Rush, the Rush Hour Secret, no, the Sensational Dry Shampoo. I love a bit of Soap and Glory, just like the next person. And Malika is obsessed. You know, if you want to know something good to get Malika, Soap and Glory all the way. Um, and I've never tried their dry shampoo before, so I'm really excited about that. And a lip oil. Oh my God, I absolutely love lip, lip oils. Lip balms and lip oils are the only lip treatments I'll use, really. Yeah, We've got ice cream liquid eyeshadow in gold outside, which is so cute and mini. Um, but look at the colour. The lip products. So we've got a Pixie by Petra Tinted Brilliance a Balm, which, once again, I would use this because it's a balm. It's not a lipstick. I don't get on with lipsticks. So I'm really excited to give that a go. This gives off real Charlotte Tilbury vibes. It is a Ted Baker. It feels just as expensive. So luxuri luxurious. And it is a... Um, it doesn't have a name on it, but it's just a made in China. It's like a lip balm kind of tinted thing. But it's a very nice neutral shade, which is once again something I would use. Especially for an evening out, you know. Now, this was so exciting to me. So this is a dupe. Um, this is a facial cleansing brush. And this is a dupe for the Frero, I think they call it. Please correct me if I'm wrong. Um... And you just use your skincare products on and you help it helps obviously help cleanse your skin clear your pores and all that fun stuff and i was just so excited when i saw this because i've really got into my skincare i really take care of my skin more and i want to sort of like help where i've got blemishes obviously my foundation has really covered it up but you know there's imperfections on my skin and i just want to keep on top of my skincare and i've got enough products to get me by a lifetime um so i'll be doing a decluster of my old ones to sift all my new stuff in um but this product this is honestly once again one of my other favorite presents she got me because i would never have thought to pick one up for myself which is why I think she's just amazing because she seems to look into my soul and see what I need. And this, which says Positive Vibes, and it's by Estella Bartlett. It's really nice. It's really good, like, handbag organiser. And we've just got some skincare put inside. So we've got some Bior Ultra Nose Strips, which are amazing. And we have a Soap and Glory Radiance Boosting Mask. So I've been very much stocked up on all my skincare products. But can we just take a moment to appreciate how nice this is? I don't know whether it's going to focus very well. But you know, and Malika, thank you so much. You well and truly spoiled me, and I really, really appreciate it. And we're going to sort your pass out because Royal Mail has thoroughly and royally pissed me off. Moving on to Matt and his family. So we're going to go with my Christmas Eve box, which you would have seen some of the things in my Christmas Eve vlog. But this is a box, it's from Home Bargain. Okay. So we've got a lot of chocolate in here, which I think is a staple of any Christmas Eve box. So I've got a massive galaxy bar. I got four bars of milk of chocolate because I love milk of chocolate and these are my favourites. Happy cow and white chocolate. Just, this is just the key to my soul. Um, we got two bags of chocolate buttons, also some of my faves. We did have two chews of jelly tops, but I have eaten one of them. Um, we got some fizzy cola bottle sweets. We got some Disney stuff, which I was not expecting at all. Um, we got some, well, three of the Minnie Mouse face masks. And then we've got this, which is a shower gel, which I think has leaked a little bit. Or it had the, no, it had the body spray that leaked on it. But how cute! Something that I asked for, a back scratcher, because when I'm not with Matt, who is my personal back scratcher, this is going to be perfect. I got it, we, I saw it in the garden centre, so yeah i was very grateful when i saw that in there and then this is all the stuff oh no this one i picked for myself but there's the rest of the stuff he picked himself and i'm very impressed but all of it he picked himself except 
to this. I got the Meggy Lashes Mystery Fill Cup. Now, if you know me, you know I love these cups. I've got a Starbucks one. I absolutely love them. And I love supporting small businesses as well. Meggy, I know, is a bit on the bigger scale now. However, still, I love supporting her. She's got some of my favourite lashes. Um, so inside, you get a super blender. It is a Christmas tree. So it's more of a novelty item for me because I'm not actually sure how I'd use it. You get a sleek mascara, which I'm really happy about because I've got her other mascara, which I'm not a massive fan of. Like, it's really good. It makes my lashes look amazing underneath the um, falsies that I put on. It makes it blend really well, but it's just a bit too messy for me. So hopefully, this will be really, really good. Then you get two pairs of lashes. I've got Style Chilled, which are really nice and curled. And then you also get the Style Curled which kind of remind me of some sort of like lash extension, which are just essentials for me, shampoos, and I love a good L'Oreal shampoo. I love going to Home Bargains, which is where I believe you got these from. Um, can I just say, for future Christmas Eve box ideas, if any of you guys want to do them for your someone you love or partner or whatever, it doesn't have to be a really expensive thing at all. I know you see some influencers and like people on like social media go really above and beyond, and that's fine if you want to do that. However, if you want to do a more affordable Christmas Eve box, which will still bring someone a lot of joy, pop to your local home bargains, B&M and The Range. They have so much amazing stuff for more affordable prices. And I love going to their, um, going to be home bargains and picking up a new L'Oreal shampoo. It may sound really sad, but it's just something I love to do. And um, Matt chose this one all by himself, which for him is a big deal. Uh, he picked this L'Oreal High Shine shampoo um, up to 48 hours sealed in gloss for dull hair. And my hair can get very dull, and I really like the idea of glossy hair. I'm just really excited about this. It's so super soft, and on the back it's got Hogwarts. Um, and it's just amazing. I just cannot believe, like, exciting. And then I can use that for when I go to his or wherever, really, when we go for staycations. I just absolutely love it. From in my stocking, I got this from Matt. I got, because we did stocking and sack. So this was the sack. I don't actually know where the stocking is currently. But from b and I want to say. Um, but in my stocking, which also had my initial on, he got me these. A body mist set. Absolutely obsessed with these. These are from Superdrug. Um... We got Sorbet, Blossom, Exotic and Paradise. Cannot wait to use these. This is the Habitat Snood and Hand Warmer Set. Honestly, my hands get so, so cold. I believe this was from Argos um, when he picked out some of my other presents. It is so unbelievably soft. I cannot even tell you, and so is this. So this is just going to be perfect for me because I, just, I just get very cold. Still, so we're going to open my sack. Okay, so I got this which is a life is better in pajamas this is from argos it's an eye mask and a massive fleecy blanket like what dreams are made of um so i've got enough of these eye masks so he picks me up another blanket which i'm gonna take this out of it because i need to keep the shape but yeah they need to be washed first which is what i'm gonna do but look how nice so it's just like a I'll just go the back a bit. It's so super soft and I'm so excited. Got me this, which I was not expecting at all. It is the Real Techniques Limited Edition 13 piece gift set. Now, I love Real Techniques just like many beauty lovers. I love their Miracle Complexion Sponge. I love some of their brushes. Um, but I haven't tried some of their stuff in a really long time now. I just kind of kind of fell off their radar a bit. And then I saw this in Superdrug and I was like, oh, well, if you want to, you know, that's something you could get me. So it has for skincare primer, foundation, powder, and shadow. So it's got an anti microfiber infusion sponge. You've got a massive selection of brushes. And I don't know what. Oh, it was a steamer cloth. Helps rejuvenate skin. And um, this is a mask applicator. Kind of reminds me of a nip cover, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> okay. Next thing he got me is the Style Pro. Um, cleans and dries makeup brushes in seconds. Now, I have had this before, but I accidentally broke it. Um, so, he did a really good job, and it's really cute. And I do really, really love this. I did prefer my Poundland cleaner, but what I've learned is, I looked on TikTok, and people use the different cleansers for this product. So, they don't use the cleanser, because a lot of people haven't got on with the cleanser that comes with the Style Pro. So, I'm going to use my own cleanser with this, and I think it's going to be absolutely amazing. Main presence which are just the best so it got me something from pandora it is this gorgeous beautiful dainty necklace absolutely gorgeous i actually saw it on the pandora website when i was looking for christmas ideas for him and he'd already picked it so shows up great minds think alike and i'm gonna send, take this off to clean and this was the first item first main christmas person he ever got me in 2019 the year we got together also from pandora so i think it's like a right passage for us and i love jewelry i love being able to keep jewelry so that's gonna go in my jewelry box 
I cannot, honestly. He got me a new pair of AirPods. Quick story time. I did have a pair of AirPods, I did. Um, but on a drunk night out, you know, it was a sign to clearly slow down a bit. Um, for some, I never used to take my AirPods out with me. For some reason this night I decided to. Worst mistake ever. Fell out my pocket, I put them back in, like, trying to, like, loving life, because I was so intoxicated. And then, next time I went to edit, one was missing. Missing. So, I couldn't edit with them. I love these AirPods. He doesn't like these particular ones. He prefers the ones with the silicone thing that's in your ear. Me, however, I prefer these. They work so much better for me. And he very, 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 very kindly got me a new set for Christmas. And I cannot even express to you guys the amount of joy. I just, yeah. His parents, which as you can see is empty, <laughs> his parents got me this, which is one of the best gifts I've ever, ever received. Um, an Aperol Spritz gift set. Now, if you don't know, if you don't know me, or you're new to my channel, or, yeah, you're just new, then you won't know. Aperol Spritz is my favourite alcoholic beverage. I will choose it over every drink. It is a mix of, obviously, Aperol, which is an Italian kind of, like, liqueur kind of thing. Um, and it's very kind of bitter, um, but it tastes really nice. And obviously, on this I would not recommend shotting it. I have done that. Not a good idea, guys. It's my friend's birthday, right? Just leave me alone. Um, so, a lot of people use soda for it, which is why it says soda, Aperol, Prosecco. I always add the Aperol first, but maybe I've been doing it wrong. Oopsies, but mine always tastes nice to me. But anyway, I use lemonade. I prefer lemonade. I'll have soda, see if I'm at a restaurant or a pub or something. But personally, when I make it myself, I prefer lemonade. Um, and then, we will go back to his parents' gifts. But we'll just go to my family. So my stocking, which was a bit of a makeshift one because my mum could find my my other stocking. So we used a wine bottle like bag. Um so I got a Harry Potter bookmark. How cute it says Harry Potter and then it's got him there just chilling on his broomstick. I got the Poor Professional Supersetter Mini, um, because the other benefit bits I chose for Christmas picked out were out of stock. So I can put that in the bin now um, while recycling. And I have tried it, but I think I used it wrong. So we're going to carry on giving it a go. Um, we have this, which I've actually got from Matt as well. So I've got one for my family, one from Matt. So I'm going to keep one for novelty because just how bloody cute. And then I'm going to use one to use. So it's a Honey Dukes Hogwarts Frog. Chocolate Frog. Honey Dukes Chocolate Frog Eyeshadow Palette. So cute. It's like a pastels kind of items. Um, oh, I also got a Golden Snitch. Oh, this is from Matt. I've got a golden snitch, um, like, necklace. I've got a snow fairy. And this is the 275 gram bottle. And it smells so bloody good. I can't wait to use it. And then I've got the snow fairy lights bath bomb. So it's three in one. You've got, like, bath fizzes. And you've got a star bath bomb. And then you've got the actual bath bomb. So you can get three baths out of this. Oh, my God. This smells so fucking heavenly. So I'm going to put that in my bath and body drawer. But yeah, so I was very spoiled. But that was my stocking. And then my mum got me this really special um, present. And it's called a Sank keychain. So I've ch ch changed my um, key rings over. I've got, like, taken quite a few off. Um, and this one's going to be going on. It says... It's just absolutely beautiful. It says... To my daughter, never forget that I love you forever. I hope you believe in yourself as much as I believe in you. And it's got a little L. Um, for my family, I also got in my stocking some Harry Potter socks. How cute. They smell like Snow Fairy right now. Um, but they're nice and woolly on the, like, fleecy on the inside. And of course they're Gryffindor. Of course, because if you didn't know, I've done the Harry Potter test numerous times. I am a, I am a Gryffindor. Where is it? It's here. Um, we have a little inside joke and... It's just so cute. She got me a Snow Fairy gift set, which is really kind of her. So you get 100 gram shower gel, 50 gram Snow Fairy body conditioner, which can make my skin smell amazing. The 180 gram Snow Fairy bath bomb and the Snow Fairy roll bubble bar. Um, and the box is really cute too. Like, look how cute and festive this is. Smells amazing. I love her. And I'm gonna put this in the bathroom. Um, ready for me to use or I'll decant it you know and just put it in my drawer and then I'm going to use this box for storage for underneath my bed um okay so this is my Christmas sack which you've probably seen in numerous years if you've watched my channel before and it's that old it's got 
a tulip leaf from Santa sign. And my mum was like, oh, I'll get you a more age appropriate Christmas sack for future years to come. I'm like, no, don't take this away. It's memories. Like my granddad used to help fill this. Do you know what I mean? So no, it's not going anywhere. Um, oh, I found the stocking. But I think I took everything out of it that was in there. But this was my stocking, which is really cute. And oh no, that's Matt. Oh, he took mine, I think, did he? I don't know. But we're going to go in with what Matt's family got me. So we've got some Matt, I think this was Matt's family. I think this was Matt's parents. We've got some reusable makeup remover puffs. You've got a large one and two small ones. These are from W7. Um, how cute are they? These Santa's workshops sort of like got a massive box of Maltesers from them because they know I love Maltesers. Um, and they clearly know that I'm like a good um, beverage because they didn't just give me the Aperol set, they got me the Vino Chic designer glassware, Jacob's Creek, Chardonnay and special de decorative wine glass. <laughs> I'm a bit scared of how predictable I am but it's so nice and I do love a good Chardonnay. Um, so obviously at the end of January, maybe even later, I will celebrate with that because it's not going to go off. So, a couple more bits I got from his parents, I got some really nice face mask orange flower and ginger and lavender and chamomile and i also got some simple face wipes which are definitely going to come in handy and then from matt's sister i got two body shop gifts so i got the kindness and pears mini gift set so you get a body butter and a refreshing shower gel and then this one is the coconut almonds nail kit so you oh, i can't get it out so you get a hand cream and a nail file which is going to come in real handy i got some of these from work um, one of my colleagues got me some Maltese truffles, so I'm going to take, I have had a couple of them already. Um, got this Bailey's and Harding limited edition Christmas set. Three shower gels, well no, there's um, two shower gels. Mulberry for two. So you've got a shower cream, Mulberry Fizz, Mulberry Fizz uh, fragrance hand and body lotion, and also a Mulberry Fizz fragrance shower gel. These bath bombs that smell amazing. I just cannot remember who got them for me. Maybe Matt's fan parents. I'm not too sure. But I'm really, really grateful. Um, and then also from work, we got a Ted Baker gift set. You get a Violet and Bergman body souffle, Rose and Karis shimmer body souffle, and a Violet and Bergman body scrub. And look how nice the box is. Like, very, very nice. Okay, my foot is no longer numb. Um, and as you can see, my blankets are up there. But... I believe these rest of these were from my family, I think. Going out and having to go do loads of Christmas shopping, order them online. So this is something that I'm really, really happy about. It is a travel digital bag. Now, this could be perfect to save the situation. It's like when I lost my SD card reader at Matt's. So you can put everything in here, cables, um, it's waterproof fabric as well. It can customise your memory. Big pocket can place many various supplies. The closing method is a zipper. Um, it's got a handle. See that? That's what it looks like on the inside. We'll take it out actually. What we're looking at is seven very vegan, very natural makeup essentials. Now I saw this and I really love the look of it. Um, the fact that it's vegan as well is amazing. Um, but yeah, that's what you get inside. Um, I probably won't use be using the lip products, but the rest of it looks amazing. The eyeshadow palette looks very me, let's be honest. Um, you get a highlighter, a mascara, um, a lengthening one, and a eyeshadow palette. Now, because I wear fake eyelashes, I'm not too bothered about mascaras, unless I'm not wearing fake eyelashes on that day. Um, and I haven't been able to wear lashes without eyeshadow, but today's makeup look I'm really happy with. But I love W7. I've loved W7 for years. I just haven't used their products as much recently. And I think Christmas and birthdays are a great opportunity to try and stuff, you know. Um, a moonlight, and it's adjustable brightness, tough control, and USB charging. Um, I saw this and I love the idea of it because obviously where I've got my freestanding ladder shelves and my Christmas decorations were going away tomorrow. So I need some bits to fill up the shelves. Um, and I love the idea of this. You can have it looking like this. Or you can have it looking brighter like this. Um, and I'm just really excited to give it a go. I'm going to unbox it in a vlog, set it up in a vlog. Um, yeah, because this is probably the only amount of DIY I can do. This isn't, isn't DIY, so it just shows you how capable I am. But I'm really excited to use this. I just love this kind of thing. Shock horror, some more body mist. Honestly, I'm so, so grateful. I love Skinny Dip as well. So we've got a Cherry Fizz scented, Peach Bellini scent, and another Peach Bellini. But this is a normal Peach Bellini body mist, and that's a shimmer one. Um, and they're perfect handbag sizes. They are... How much do you get in here? They're cruelty and 
vegan free um so you get 100 ml per bottle and i absolutely love skinny dip fragrances and then i also got the just a peachy sugar scrub because this is also the peach bellini one um because i love peach scented things i love skinny dip skincare products and their body care products so i can't wait to give this a go um and i did ask for that one and then once again as i said benefit didn't have the things that i like looked at originally however this i'm really excited about um so this is the lashes all the way how cute is the tin like i'm sorry it's a christmas stocking um so this is a their reel so you get the full size supercharged black and then you get the mini supercharged black mascara um so yeah i don't think i've actually tried the real their real one i've tried the w7 dupe of because can i say w7 have amazing dupes for loads of high-end products that benefit especially they have like a dupe for the hula bronzer their real mascara you know they're the things i've tried i've never actually tried the real ones you know the ones that they're based off so i'm really excited to give these a go um and i love benefit makeup and i think benefit makeup makes such a good christmas gift too um i got a lush gift set um it is the christmas candy box you get a snowman dreaming butter bear candy cane and snow fairy um so oh, it smells amazing so i cannot wait to actually open this up um and decant the stuff into my bathroom and into my bathroom body drawer because then you know it saves on packaging i can recycle everything um but yeah lush once again is something that i only really go to at christmas now i used to buy this stuff all the time i used to be absolutely bath bomb obsessed um you know i go through you go through those phases but christmas isn't christmas in my opinion you know without some lush and snow fairy so i'm very grateful for that and then in this box i was mis i thought it was function of beauty i was thinking oh okay but actually inside is the chocolate frog eyeshadow palette that my family gave me which is amazing and then some reusable masks because i never had masks and my mum knew this so you know in the climate that we're in these are an amazing christmas present um so you get how much you get it's a reusable um pouch as well so you can actually keep them in here in your handbag so you know where they always are um i don't know how many how many five it's more than five um but they're proper good quality they're easy to clean eco-friendly reusable skin friendly and breathable cotton which is important for me because i think that's another reason why i'm breaking out so many spots since masks became mandatory again you know um so yeah i'm very excited about those um and as i said in this current climate face masks are a good present to get and then the last thing in here which honestly made my day when i opened you know i was grateful for everything of course is the love mrs hinge life in list so i've got her original one um, and i've actually been using it so this is her original one the little book of lists um and then this is her newer one which obviously i've got my christmas wish list you can never have too much mrs hinge in your life okay and i've also got mrs hinge's book as well under there so this can add to my collection um but i'm really excited to use this because i am really in the spring cleaning mood i want to spend the next couple of weekends deep cleaning my room organizing my room so you can keep your eyes peeled for that on my channel um because there's not going to be much main content on my channel now um for a little while after this video i'm going to focus on just organizing myself getting myself into good routines and whatever i film with that then you'll see at some point on your obsession um so yeah like the aesthetic of her obviously she's moved into her new well she will be moving into her hinch farm home her original home is so my aesthetic that's like my dream you know obviously i have my own touches but yeah so i'm gonna put some just yeah they could all be mrs hinch now so i can organize on like my little shelf on my bedside cabinet and it's all gonna be mrs hinch and it makes me so happy so yeah as you can see i was well and truly spoiled this christmas i am so so grateful to everyone that gifted me something and i hope you all loved your christmas presents that i got you guys if you're watching this and i gave you a christmas present um there is a giveaway over on my christmas eve vlog which is still live It'll be live for another week or two um a like couple of weeks so make sure you've got an end to that as two mystery beauty bundles um they, the winners will be picked at random make sure you comment um subscribe and like obviously that video um if you're being chance for winning it's just like a late christmas kind of gift from me to you guys um but yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it let me know what your favorite gift you got for christmas was or your favorite gift you gave for christmas um so yeah um thank you so much for watching don't forget to smash a big thumbs up subscribe if you have not already and i'll see you in my next vlog or video whichever one you watch first bye